We're on the air. We're doing things. Woo! Still We're getting learning. stuff. Uh, welcome. We're gonna... This we're is gonna... Chicken and Waffle. I'm a chicken. And I'm a waffle. We are so fucked up. She's on all sorts of fun medications and I am just exhausted after a bachelorette party. So, enjoy this. This will be fun. We've been meaning to get this video out for, god, what, like a month now? More than that. It was a little around when we first got Minecraft. Jesus but Alright, well, so this is our behind the games video, so if we don't respond to your comments, I apologize, but we're trying to keep it under a certain time. I might end up cutting all of the beginning of this out, but that's okay. Anyway, here we go. So we're gonna play a game, and it's gonna be versus. And it's gonna be... Do you want to tag a bitch? Let's tag a bitch. Tagging a bitch. Welcome to our Behind the Games. This is Chicken and Waffle. And this is 10 things that you don't know about us yet. And, um... Oh yeah, I forgot all of them are locked. Whatever. We'll just futz around. It'll be cool. You know, we need to buy this one eventually. Because I want to yeah. unlock all the characters. I just want my steampunk costume back. Where is it? That's not it. That's not it. Ooh. That's not it. Uh, so yeah. No. You're about to learn ten things you didn't know about us. I'm wearing oh. the bikini. I'm just gonna let my titties hang out. Oh no, I'm gonna be Santa. Can I- Oh, I can't let my titties hang out. I'll be Santa with you. Awesome. Should we just random the comms? Yeah, sure. I don't... I don't... What are you asking me? Just... hit enter. Okay. You gonna random it? Or you can pick oh. that guy. It, it, it just... That one. There you go. Alright. So. Number one, as it's loading up the whole thing and everything. The first thing you guys wanted to know was how we met. Any specific place you wanna go? Random, 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 random. Cool. Um, Not where we met, though. Uh, we met in high school, randomly in Japanese class, which is a great place to- oh god. Hold what on. What are we doing? We should probably turn down the things, because it sounds loud. Oh yeah. But yeah, we met in a Japanese class, <laughs> which was fantastic. It was fantastic. Um... I, if I remember correctly, Sensei was being his normal dumbass self, and you made some passive aggressive bullshit comment. What am I. It's you. I know, but it's. I'm not doing anything. Uh, oh, how do I get in here again? Ha. Aw. I think you cut me out. Only one of us in at a time. That's how this works. That is so weird. Well, that's tag team. I don't know how that works. Anyway, so we met in Japanese class, and that was super fun. Um, oh. Nope, nope. Your turn. <laughs> I love these throws. <laughs> but, uh... And so you made this, like, smart-ass comment about how annoying Sensei was. Well, because he was a fucking annoying, and to be fair... Oh, it's my turn. Uh, oh. To be fair... I had already dealt with him for, like, a, a year. Yeah, and I hadn't. I had just started Japanese class. So you made some smart-ass comment, and I laughed like a fucker. And then you said something else, and I was like, Oh, you know what? You know what? Just fucking bite me, why don't you? And then you did. And I was so confused. Don't worry about being here too long. We're not gonna be here very long at all. Um, we're still doing behind the games, so. But, uh, yeah. She told- she was like, oh, just bite me! And I was like, okay! Because in the mornings, at school, for- and for all you lovely people who don't know me how I was in school. Get her, uh, get her, get her. I actually spent most of my time zombieing through school. It was, uh, kind of ridiculous. Oh, I don't- I don't even know, but that was fantastic. Um, most of my time zombie through school, I honestly looked like I was probably gonna murder things every day. Um, and she was like, just bite me! And I was, nah. in my head I was like, you know what, nah. alright, fine, I will, I will just bite you. And so I just leaned over, which she was like a little bit across the way from me, for dis desk-wise. 
And I leaned over and I really? bit her on the shoulder and she just grabbed her shoulder and looked at me like, I can't believe you! How dare you do this to me? And I was just like, you, you told me to bite you. And she was just like, but I didn't think you'd actually yeah. do it! <laughs> like, well, don't tell me to do it then. Dude, we fucked them up. But yeah, no, so that's how we met. And that's also kind of goes into question too, was what was our first impression of each other? Honestly, my first impression of you, uh, I thought you were really timid and kind of kept oh, to dude, yourself and really focused. And, uh, I honestly thought you weren't going to like me, to be 100% honest. So, to be almost 10 years down the road later. Oh, ow. Kind you of a shocking bitch. situation. Fuck you. Fuck you and your sister and your girlfriend and every <laughs> single one of you. You can fucking take it in the tits. I'm not particularly sure what your first impression of me was. My um, first impression of you was that you were fucking hilarious and also <laughs> you didn't take no shit, which was fun. And I kind of enjoyed it because I didn't get to hang out with people like that very often. Bam. I don't know. My yeah, turn. There you are. All right. Um, but yeah, so that was my first impression of you, was that you're hilarious and that you don't- you don't take no shit. I like how she's just in a bikini. Like, what the fuck ever. It's okay, I'm in Santa's clothes. Santa's fuck's... gonna beat you up. Bam. Santa come more than we once We took them down year. fast. But, uh... So the next question we have, which I'm sure is a burning question for most people, is, uh... Where does the world rifle? Where so, did Wifel come from? And this yeah. is this is Wifel's story. She's a hundred percent my story. So I, I went to this speech impediment, which I'm sure has been in flying colors if you guys have ever just sat and watched us for a while and listened to me babble my lovely concoction of words and shit. Oh I got KO'd. You gotta um, go. Oh shit. Um <laughs> She kicks my nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Yet I'm the only one that has the actual nuts. Um, she fucked up my nuts. My nuts are gone. Well, one of the things about Japanese class, because it's where we hung out the most for the longest time, um, is that we got told we argued like a, a married couple. So we were always told, uh, we were just looked at them and we were like, yeah, because I love my wife. We didn't even really talk about it or anything. We just kind of like agreed with it. And oh, how ow. fucking dare that was a you, cunt? How you like me now, bitch? Um, <laughs> Take me down, you fucker. And, nice. uh, one morning, <laughs> well, don't you just have my cocky attitude? Um, yep. Bam. one morning, I really wanted waffles. I wanted waffles so bad. I was thinking of the nice German Belgian waffles, and I wanted to get her attention about it. That is an interesting outfit that dude has on. Um, and, uh, needed to get her attention. And fucking like I, we were at the bus stop in the morning because that's usually where we hung out in every morning before school because she would come to school on the bus and I'd walk to school because I wasn't that far and uh, I looked at her and I was like Wifel! And she, <laughs> she just looked at me like what? I was like I... Wife? And it's just kind of a speech and impediment I've never gotten to live down. Oh, there you go. You're so in. it's just become that thing where... It, it also... The thing that we never have taught them about is your dance as well. Oh, the wifel dance? Yes, the wifel <laughs> dance. I had, okay, so our, our high school had this really shitty, shitty fucking tables. This half circle, half oil. Get the fuck off me, cunt. Waffle. D -d -d bitch. All right, and uh, <laughs> oh, and uh, I had slammed my knee. Oh Jesus! On the fucking underside, and I had st stood up so fast, and I was just spinning in a circle, holding my knee up, <laughs> and it became the wifel dance because she thought it was hilarious. Because she was like, "What the fuck are you doing?" I just I hit my knee, and it hurt. <laughs> So bad. <laughs> so fucker. Every now and again, if she's having a bad day, I'll just look at her and I'll do the little spin around while flailing my arms all over the place and be like, "The wifel dance." <laughs> Makes her giggle every time. Dude, those 
Those fucking grabs are almost entirely easy to grab. It's so great. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> so what's next under the list? Or do you have anything to add to that one? Uh, no. That was that was your story. That was pretty. Whee! Hey, that was appropriate. <laughs> uh, how did we come up with our name? Actually, the next question. Oh, that one was actually funny. We were actually talking a little bit about that before we uh, started doing this. Um. Let's do this. We were actually sitting down one night because it was at the time where I was uh, working uh, late. She was doing uh, overnights and uh, she would oh come God. home and we would have the most random conversations. Because, you know, that's what we do. We were talking about potato chips of all things and how they just been getting out of control with their freaking flavors of things. And, uh, hey, that's not okay. We were also at the time starting to play. Uh, Lego Hobbit? It was Lego Hobbit, yeah, yeah, that's the one we were playing. It wasn't Lord of the Rings, because we got really annoyed with Lord of the Rings. Oh my god, it was stupid. Stupid hard. Um, yeah, but we were ridiculously annoying. And it was making us laugh so bad that we afterwards started... Uh, there you are. Oh, oh, oh. Jesus, tits. I have no idea what just happened there. Nope, I think you nope, both nope, just tried nope, the same nope, grab. Nope, nope, nope. Yours. <laughs> Oh, um, wow. He's got some talking skills. Talking about all the different flavors Bam. of Blaze, and one of the ones that came up was chicken and waffle. Or, no, or chicken, chicken and waffles. waffles. I'm sorry, yes. There's already because a flavor of potatoes here called chicken and waffles. Um, don't mind us. And it's, it's especially apt because I'm actually from southern Mississippi. So, you know, southern food is big for me, and chicken and waffles is kind of a weird one because it's not actually technically southern, but I love, love gravy, love biscuits, love- oh my gosh, No, my turn. There you go. You can have it. I was letting you have it, but then the game said no. Um, but yeah, so it was literally just, we were sitting there talking about it, and I was like, you know what, we should call ourselves Chicken and Wifle. It'll be a play on words. It'll be great. And I thought it was amazing, and so the more we, the more we ended up going around and listening to ourselves and thinking about it, the more we realized that, do you want to change characters, or are we good? Yeah, we can change characters. Um, the more we realized that it was actually a really apt name, so we just kind of stuck with it. And that was cool, so... And it's not like we spent a lot of time thinking about it either, we were just like... No. It was a few seconds and then it was done. It's like, do you want to be chicken and waifu? And I was like, I love it, let's do it now. Let's stick with Santa. Okay. I like the Santa theme we got going on. We're bringing all the presents this year. Oh yeah. All the presents. Alright, did we actually answer that question? I'm fairly sure we did. About how we got our name? Yeah. Yeah. Alright. And since Wifel, we we actually call ourselves off screen. We each call each other Wifel. Because that's just what we've always called each other since. Which is why you'll hear her slip up and call me Wifel every now and again. Because that's just how we roll. It's what we do. Wifel! I've called her it for like 10 years now, so... <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> You gotta pick oh, the right, random. Oh, right, 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 right. I, I can do things, I promise. Um, let's see. It's the one after that. The one after that one is one of my favorites, and it is what are our, our favorite games. Oh, Jesus. You start. Oh, I get- okay. Well, let's see here. I like Spyro. Oh, I like Metal Gear Solid. Metal Gear Solid, I get yeah. that in the anime oh, mixed up shit. for whatever fuckity reason. He's um, apparently just gonna wear the Santa outfit too, because why the fuck not? Because <laughs> Santa comes more than once a year this year. Um, get, do the fucking bullshit. But uh, also I like Final Fantasy VIII. I like a lot of MMO. The list goes on forever. Like honestly, one day I actually sat, sat down and down. Oh, I also like Bubble Bobble, which is from the NES games. A childhood favorite of mine, along with uh, Zelda, Metroid. Uh, uh, I'm getting good uh, at this. It, it's it's a long list. Like I actually sat down and wrote down all the consoles I've ever played on before, and it went on literally for a paragraph. Nope, oh, you're. Nope, that's the other guy. Never mind. Went on for a paragraph. All the different consoles. Oh yeah. Hey, kill it. We're big fans of PC gaming because. PC gaming is lovely and Steam is amazing, but unfortunately we haven't had the capabilities to uh, 
do any PC gaming for the most part, so it's been kind of rough, but we're huge PC gaming fans. Um, but she was originally, I believe I want to say you were originally a Nintendo girl. Oh wait, that is this was me? No. Oh. That's you. Um, you were originally a Nintendo girl, if I'm right? Um, actually, no. it was kind of somewhere a tie between Sega Genesis and Nintendo. Yeah. Um, but I was a big Sony girl. So I fell in love with Spyro, Kingdom Hearts, uh, all the Final one. Fantasies. Um, I then went on to try out Xbox and fell in love with Oblivion. And that was my first, like, 100% true love where I would play this game until... Good, now we're not all in Santa outfits. Though you want to know what's nope. kind of funny about us playing Dead and Alive and talking about all this? What's that? Is, uh... Oh, that's you. Oh, I actually awesome. remember playing one of the beginning, I think it was like Dead or Alive 3, I want to say, on the Xbox, the original Xbox. Oh, wow. Yeah. I never played the original Xbox because my parents thought it was the devil or whatever. Well, to be fair, it was a crappy system. Yeah. And it had all the first-person shooters. Oh my god, bitch. You better cut that one. Oh, I'm going to. She's gonna <laughs> know my pain. Like that. Do it again. Do it again. Punch her in the dick. Oh my god, get out. Why'd you move in the dick? <laughs> god damn it. Fucking bitch. Jesus. No, don't you get up. But, but yeah. yeah. So that was, that's, <laughs> our, that's our favorite games. We're the same person. You guys should know this by now. Um, the next one is, what is your first gaming experience? Like, the first game we ever played. Like, played together, or, like... Uh, let's do both. I think the first game we actually played together... And this is gonna actually crack me up really bad the more I think about it. I think it was Dark Cloud. I think it was Dark Cloud. I think <laughs> that was the first game we legitimately, like, played... I. We probably played Mario Kart at one point because my baby brother was a huge- Oh, that's you. Oh, now it's me. Now it's- I don't know what's going on. Oh, now it's you. Okay. <laughs> oh, and he's dead. See? Same person. Anyway. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, I think honestly the first one we played together together was fucking- Dark Cloud? Yeah, yeah it was Dark Cloud. I can't wait to play that for you guys. It's gonna be so much fun. But what was the first game that you played, like, that you remember playing that was- Oh god, he's like covered in zombies. I'd have to say the first game I honestly remember playing- oh, that's you. Oh, would that's have to be, you uh- need to kick her ass. I'd have to say Sonic the Hedgehog on the Sega Genesis. And then along- Jesus, tits. Along with that, I'd have to say, uh, Super Mario Brothers with my dad on the NES. He showed me all the shortcuts. Pretty cool. I remember most of them. So. Oop. Yeah. Oh. The first game you played. The first game I played. Um, so I have actually two games that I consider the first game I ever played. Because my dad was a huge Sony fan, so we had all of the very first Spyro games. It was uh, Spyro the Dragon, Spyro Year of the Dragon, Spyro Ripto's Rage, and Spyro Enter the Dragonfly. Those were the games that we played, like, all the time. So the first game that I ever played was Spyro Year of the Dragon. God damn it. And that was the one that my dad, like, had to have. So I played that one, and that was my first gaming experience in general, but I was never terribly good at it. The game that I played for myself for the first time, like, I picked a game and got my dad to buy it and played it all the way through, start to finish, like, all by myself, no help, was Kingdom Hearts 2. And that was when I realized that storyline gaming was actually a thing, and I could play these games and essentially live out the lives of these characters in an animated environment, which is just really cool. Your character's got some really cool moves. Yeah. So I really want to get the story mode for this game at some yeah, point. Yeah, I'm liking it. But yeah, those were my first- like, I consider them both to be my first experience because they were both like really big for me, really big turning points in my gaming history. Alright. 
why did we start streaming? Okay, so that's actually kind of a really funny, funny one. one. So, uh, after school every day, we used to sit at the bus stop. stop. Because, she, uh, again, she had to ride, ride the bus home, and it never mattered when I came home. But my little sister- oh, we got cheerleaders. Uh, my little sister didn't get out of school until, like, two hours after I did. And so I just had to meet her at school. So we'd sit at the bus stop for two, three hours at a time and wait for the last bus before my sister got out of school. I'm just gonna fucking kick her in the face hole. Give me the face. We would have so many interesting interactions with random people who would either A, come up to us or whatever. Because, quite honestly, uh... I have no idea what just happened. Oh, that's what that is. Okay. Quite honestly, uh, there you go. I almost either never wore shoes or just didn't feel the need to. I honestly will wear whatever the fuck I want because I I just don't care how other people feel. Like, I used to wear a dog collar to school, okay, people? It didn't matter to me. <laughs> it was a cute dog collar, though. It was purple. It was uh, Odin's, actually. Oh, was it really? Yeah. Yeah. Um, but, uh... And we used to just have the funniest conversations. We'd crack people up all the time and we'd crack Crack ourselves up. So hard. We used to talk about all the time about taking our comedy and the road and stuff. And as technology progressed and got, you know, more advanced and things became, you know, we grew up, we think became more accessible to us and everything. We just kind of looked at each other and we're like, you know what? We came every night anyways together. Cracking each other up. Oh god, I got knocked out. Her boyfriend go. up. Go, would go, be go, 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 upstairs go. trying to sleep. And then I was just like, you know what? Why don't we just stream the shit? Let's finally share our comedy with the world. Let's do this. And yeah. So here we are, chicken and waffle. Unfortunately, we finished Lego Hobbit before we started streaming because Lego Hobbit is really where we shone. Oh my gosh, it was beautiful and amazing. Message. Not saying that we don't get a lot of our funnies out now. A lot of them still get out. I just love how the, the bottom half of the coat just curls up like a penis. It's just like, yep. whoop. <laughs> but yeah, no, I can't wait. There's so many games that we want to go back and revisit because they were just big parts of our lives. Oh, I suppose we gotta change characters. Whatever. I don't care. We're doing it now. It's over. There's not very many characters to flip through anyway, so. Oh, that's you. Well. That's I don't. You know. I don't even know what happened. <laughs> I don't know either, but you just kind of fucked in there. So, uh, well, what is our favorite part about streaming? Honestly, for me, it's two things. First of all, I am a really socially anxious person, so getting wow, you're getting fucked up. I was noticing that. So getting to hi, we're streaming. We're doing a thing. Um, getting to like share this sorts of things with people and everything else is really fun. And getting to talk to like-minded people without having to leave my house is awesome. Those are important things to uh, me. Need you to take over. <laughs> well, then you gotta start talking. Um, my favorite thing about streaming, honestly, not only getting to meet all the new people, but oh, I fuck you. get to fuck you and play games fuck and you. have fun <laughs> with my chicken. Bitch. Bitch! And I get all you fun people, bitch. and I, I just love having the sarcastically good fun time, and just it, it's just nice being able to get to know you people. Like there's times where, especially with all of these recent illnesses and things we've been having to deal with, there's been times I've looked at a chicken here and I'm like, oh my god, I just want to scream. I miss all these people so bad. Oh yeah, no, so many times we've done that. And it's- it's rough sometimes, especially with all the treatments we're going through and everything. That's you. Um, it's- it's rough trying to, like, put everything together and try and get back to streaming. Like, we've been trying to make this video for two months, you guys. We love you so much, but it's so hard sometimes. Um, but it's- this is honestly one of our favorite parts of the day, is getting to do this with you guys. And the fact that we get to try out new games and show people new games and- Oh, uh, we're just such gamers, it's ridiculous. We enjoy trying new things too much. Oh, wow, you're getting oh. fucked up. Your turn. <laughs> so what's next? next question is, uh, what are our life dreams and goals? Oh, jeez. Uh, actually... Penis coat. 
Yes, that's our life, dreams and goals, is penis coat. Um, <laughs> yeah, we we're all we're just doing all Santa outfits. That's our that's our thing today. Um I don't actually think I've played her yet. we've been kind of running around the idea of uh possibly taking the economy to the next stage. To like an actual live stage, if I yeah. remember correctly. Yeah, that's something I wouldn't be against. I think that's I a, think something we've actually a, been talking about, Santa? and uh, yeah, there's the Santa. we're kind of excited about the idea. Now? We're mulling it around. Um, we're also thinking about uh, just to test out the idea to start to do a little bit of podcasting. Yeah, so we're thinking about because we do our nightly walk to QFC and stuff like that, and that's where a lot of our inside jokes come from that we have to explain to you guys later. So why don't we start? podcasting them and seeing if we can do that and stuff. So that's something we're thinking about doing if you guys would be interested. I'll start a uh, a thing so you guys can vote on a thing, whether or not you want to do that, and that would be cool. Um, but yeah. Other than that, our life dreams and goals are just to make enough money that we don't have to worry about it anymore. Oh my god, we're so sexy. That's you. <laughs> no, that's me. Oh, that's you. Oh, oh now I'm going you to get to fight me. yourself. Oh, no, you need to get out of there. <laughs> I'm sorry, you gotta get out. You get uh, what's our next up. one? Uh, the next one is the last one, and I specifically want to make sure that I give credit to the person who asked us this, because this question is one of my favorites. This question is from Lepernal. Lepernal's one of our pros on YouTube and stuff like that. He hangs out on Twitch and stuff as well sometimes. Um, and Lepernal wants to know who likes waffles more. Who likes waffles more? Yeah. Do you like waffles? Yeah, I like waffles. Do you like pancakes? Yeah, I like pancakes. Do you like French toast? Yeah, I like French toast. Do do do. Can't wait to get a mouthful of waffles. Oops. You're doing a really bad job just back flipping around him. Actually, out of the two of us, I think you are a much bigger fan of waffles. Probably. Like, I'm just a much bigger fan of breakfast. Yeah. Then again, I love cooking, so. Makes I'm sense. a lot bigger fan of fruits and veggies. And oatmeal. Yeah, that's true. I eat a lot of oatmeal. Freaking rabbit. <laughs> and I really like citrus. So, yeah, no. Out of the two of us, she likes waffles a lot more than I do. I don't even but... know what's going on anymore. <laughs> I'm in. I'm in. Oh, um, oh Also, another thing we wanted to bring up that I'm actually really excited to do, which you're going to have to fight for a second to survive, because I'm going to have to... <laughs> to describe. Uh, we're actually going to be starting to have more of a scheduled uh, streaming thing that we're going to be doing. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. A Monday through Sunday thing. Um, so the actual streaming days that we're going to be streaming, games, of course, will always be swapped out as necessary. But for right now, we have streaming days on Monday, Wednesday, th Monday, Wednesday, Fridays, and Sundays. Mondays are going to be our Minecraft days, Wednesdays are going to be Bloodborne, Fridays are going to be uh, Transistor, and then Sundays are going to be Last of Us. Of course, this is all until we either finish a game or we feel like it's, we've just spent enough time on it. Yeah, I think we're, it's, the, the main basis for how we were going to do it was going to be Minecraft Mondays was just kind of going to be our multiplayer day, and then Wednesdays and... Fridays? Oh no, I guess it's all three of them. All three of the other days were just kind of going to be solo play days where we pick the other games that we're doing. Yeah. But uh, for Minecraft, we're looking at anywhere from 6 to 9 uh, p.m. Pacific Northwest time. Uh, for Bloodborne, we're doing somewhere between midnight and 1, still all the same. We're, we're going to start shortening it down for how long we're playing for those ones. Minecraft we're keeping a little long because, well, it's fucking Minecraft and we just find shit to do. That's hilarious. Um, and then Transistor, which is on Fridays, they're going to be 6 to, like... And, and, of course, all of this, you guys don't have to write it down. We're eventually going to have it all up on our site and yeah, stuff. Yeah, I just didn't want to put it on Twitch until we had announced it on the thing. But we're going to have a schedule, so take a look down below pretty soon and we're going to keep the schedule thing on the thing so you guys can keep track of that because that'd be cool um, also we're going to be trying to actually uh, oh, ritualistically <laughs> upload uh, videos on Saturday evenings so that we can start having that 
so we can start having things out on YouTube for you guys a little bit sooner in case you know you miss something or you know you want to go back and see some of our earlier parts of it. Uh, again, we we do this for you guys. We're amused as hell to do it, but we get more of a joy out of it the more you guys are having fun with us. So. Let's put it this way, we ended up doing a game testing stint for a little while, and during our lunch break we managed to crack up a few people. And we were exhausted- oh, apparently we're going to a different stage. Um, and we were exhausted, but we cracked these people up, and so we started, like, really giving it our all while we were doing it, and, uh, eventually it got to the point that somebody tried to call us on it, and I was like, no, what you don't understand is we can hear you all laughing, and that's why we're still going. Like, we don't make jokes just for ourselves. We get a really quiet when it's just the two of us. <laughs> I mean, don't get us wrong. Sometimes when it's just the two of us, like, even once we get the podcast going where we can actually have it to where you guys can hear some of our, uh, more interesting conversations when it's just us roaming about, uh, we, we do get a little obnoxious sometimes, admittedly. But it, it's funnier than shit. Uh. But, uh. Ooh. That one was for the most nice. part, if, like, we're super tired and... If we're not entertaining anybody, we just kind of just... <laughs> Conk. Oh, so... yeah. We're very lazy people when it comes down to it. But yes, so the last announcements that we have are... Make sure you look in the descriptions down below everything. We're going to have our schedule coming up soon. We're going to have more, hopefully more artwork coming out of you soon. Because you've got a whole bunch of stuff started, just not finished. Yeah. And once you get off of all the... That's all I'm saying. (laughs) Once you get off all of the stuff. Speaking of which, health things. uh, She's doing a lot better. She got her surgery and stuff going and stuff. And I might be going in for an MRI soon and a few other things. So we're getting to the road of recovery. And, um... So that's cool. But, yeah, keep an eye out for our schedule. Keep an eye out for the new donation thing that I got going on down in the bottom. If you want to help, that is definitely a great way to go. That we can get our PCs built and our capture card going, so... It just means we'll have more things to be able to entertain you guys yes. with. Which is really, honestly, all we really want it for. Oh my god, really? Come we on. really just want to entertain you guys. Because when we're entertaining you guys, we're entertaining ourselves. And it's just, it's like a circle jerk, except better, because it's not selfish. <laughs> yeah, everyone is being selfless, which is my favorite part. Boop, boop. I'm just going to smash her into the ground. But yeah, we're probably, I don't think we're going to be doing this very much longer. I'm just kind of doing this to fill space, because I know you wanted to look at things. But, uh, yeah. Anyways, keep an eye out. We should be starting that streaming schedule here very soon, so hopefully we'll do uh, Minecraft tomorrow and then go from there. Um, anything else? Although it might be a little bit later tomorrow, because I do have physical therapy. Yeah, hypothetically we should be back before we mm, usually start. I'm not going to be back until like 6, just after 6. Uh, either way. We... The idea okay. is still there. Either way, we'll still make it happen. Um, any changes? <laughs> we're, we're not planning on dying anytime soon, stay at home gamer. That's why we're doing our best to keep our health on the up and up and get it back on the up and up. Um, but yeah, any changes in schedules that could either be like last minute or whatever, definitely oh, keep, there's a keep an eye on us on uh, Twitter. Because we, we are almost always on there. <laughs> oh, yes, please. Message me on Twitter. Message me on Facebook. Because I love hearing from you guys. Like, stay at home gamer. You're our bro. And you're um. always on there retweeting stuff and putting cool messages up, which is great. Yes, yes, yes. Bay Noodle's there, too. And you guys saw earlier today, I actually told my Brendan that I was going to put him up there. So he was streaming a little bit of Rocket League earlier today. If you want to check that out, you can check our Twitter as well. But yeah, no. We're hoping to start getting this going again and here again soon. And we love you guys. This one's a short one today because, again, we're still healing. Um, I'm fighting off all of the medications I'm on right now to stay awake for this. So yeah, we no. love you guys. Like we'll try and, and be here more for you. We're definitely um, not stopping. This is a, a short 
reprieve in our long-term plans. Uh, I hope you guys continue loving us, and we'll continue loving you, and we'll be back as soon as we possibly can. Um, yeah, that's all I got. What about you? Uh, yeah, nope. Other than that, you know, social media, donations, click panels, do things, there are buttons, and you should click them, and other than that, we love you. Uh, check out our YouTube. Definitely check out our YouTube. We're doing some fun things with that. I'm doing some clips and things, so have fun with that. And keep an eye out soon for a uh, new opening sequence on our YouTube videos. Hopefully we'll be able to start doing some s cool stuff with things. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm Wifel. She's... I'm a chicken. And we're out of here. See you guys around, alright? We love right? you guys. We'll be back eventually. I promise. <laughs>